Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, depending on where you are. Great to see all of you. I'm uh, Patrick McGovern, and I'm delighted to be here representing the Patrick J. McGovern Foundation. I'd like to welcome the NeuroAbilities community tuning in from around the world. I want to begin by recognizing the terrific G3 ICT team behind the NeuroAbilities program, especially Excel Lebois, who spent many years working closely with my father, Pat McGovern, as both president and CEO of IDG Communications and IDC. Today, Excel is a champion of the rights of persons with disabilities in the digital age. Axel, thank you for your leadership and collaboration. The foundation is honored to be part of this initiative to create a more equitable, inclusive, and accessible world. On behalf of all the trustees, I want to thank the community gathered here today for what promises to be a fascinating conversation. Our foundation carries on the legacy of my father who had a lifelong fascination with the human brain. He established one of the world's leading neuroscience research institutes at MIT, the McGovern Institute for Brain Research. And he was also years ahead of his time in recognizing that technology can be used for the betterment of humanity. With his trademark optimism, he believed technology could democratize information, accelerate human achievement, and solve our greatest challenges. NeuroAbilities uniquely brings together this uh, cutting edge of neuroscience and technology for the betterment of humanity. It is nothing short of extraordinary to consider the impact this technology can have on future generations. My father was also a master communicator and convener who traveled the world bringing diverse groups of people together. He had a deep commitment for sharing knowledge, uh, insights, and ideas for public good. In that spirit, I believe he would be thrilled to see NeuroAbilities is here creating a space for advocates, neuroscientists, and persons with disabilities to come together to promote research and innovation and prioritize the perspective of those who use these technologies. At the Patrick J. McGovern Foundation, we are carrying the, the torch of my father's optimism. And one of the most promising frontiers of tech for good is the assistive technology that improves lives and enhances human potential. I'm really excited for today's opportunity to learn from the perspective of a neuroscientist and a user with neurotechnology stands today and the promise it holds for the future. Thank you again for, for joining us today and I'm gonna pass the 